Good evening and welcome to tonight's episode of Ask Leah. Question for you, how often do you consider your body language? The way you show up, the way you move about a room, the way you sit in a meeting, the energy you bring. If your answer is not very often, then I want you to try to get more conscious of the way you move about in the world. Because here's the thing, my specialty is communication and communication is so much more than the words that you speak. Your body language, your energy communicates a message too. And often people believe your body language over anything that comes out of your mouth. Yet it's something that a lot of us are not intentional about. The reason I wanted to share this tonight is because I was recently working with a leader who needed to work on improving his presence. You see, he was a relatively new leader. He was trying to make a good impression and he is a very clever guy. He is a great thinker and he likes to ponder things. But what he wasn't considering was the body language that he was showing up with. And to be frank, having sat in a couple of meetings with this guy, his body language was communicating a very different message to what he intended. Essentially, his body language was saying, I'm not really that interested. I'm pretty tuned out. Uh, I'm not paying attention to what other people are saying. Because he is that deep thinker and more introverted, he was in his own mind, but the way it was coming off was that he was really disinterested. Not what you're going for when you are in quite a senior leadership position. So what I've been working on with this leader is his presence. And one of the activities I've got him to do is before he goes into a meeting, before he goes out onto the floor to have conversations with people, I'm getting him to just take a moment to consciously think, what does this situation require of me? What sort of energy? What uh, am I trying to convey in this meeting? And then how do I need to show up to communicate that? So it's just a tiny little check-in. It doesn't take much time, only a few seconds of conscious effort, and it's having a massive impact on his uh, body language and energy during these meetings. So I want you to try it too. Think about what you wanna be known for, the perception you're trying to give people, and then make sure your body language and energy levels are communicating that. If you have a communication, leadership, self-leadership, emotional intelligence, tricky people stuff question you would like answered, send it through and I will do my best to answer it for you next week. Cheers.